there are very real examples of selling sickness, of disease mongering, of widening the boundaries of illness. And the media plays a critical role in this. One of the campaigns that's happening before our eyes is the selling of a condition called hypoactive sexual desire disorder. Take a look at this. The majority of women experience at some point in their life a loss of sexual desire that comes and goes. But for one in ten women, there's a little more serious situation. It's called hypoactive sexual desire disorder, or HSDD. That was just one small part of a much bigger global campaign to educate the world about this new condition called hypoactive sexual desire disorder, which is claimed to affect up to one in ten women. Uh, this campaign is specifically being funded by Boehringer Engelheim, a drug company uh, that was at that point hoping to have its new drug approved for this condition. We all go through ebbs and flows, but there, you know, there's a real disorder or dysfunction called hypoactive sexual desire disorder or HSDD. What you don't hear in these media appearances is that the drug company is footing the bill for, for this awareness raising campaign. It basically is, um, you know, it affects about 30% of women in this country. 30%? 30%. That was another extract from United States television earlier this year.